You know, once I read over the transcript, I could see how my words might have been misconstrued. Thanks for trying to help me, Dad. Maybe we'll find me a friend tomorrow. Yes, we will. And if not then, then the next day. And if not then, then the next day. And if not then, we'll give up. Because that will have been four days, and that's enough. Hey, there's Lester Crinklesacks, boy. What are you doing, Ernie? Playing kick the can. I didn't know you could play that alone. Well, I don't have any friends. Oh, Daddy! Wear your damn seatbelt. Ernie, this is my son Cleveland Jr. He doesn't have any friends either. You want to play kick the can? Do I? That's okay. I didn't get it at first either. I'll teach you how. All right. Now you halfwits have a good time. And then the old lady was hobbling after us because the crab apple we threw broke her windshield and she tripped over a surveying flag and landed in the mud. <laughs> <laughs> I bet even she had to laugh at that one. <laughs> I tell you, Ernie, it's nice having you here. Looks like I'm not the only one around here with a white boyfriend. Oh, ho, ho, ho. she's trying to call you homosexuals, Cleveland Jr. and Ernie. That's funny. I'm going to use that. I'm going to use it right now. Y'all are homosexuals. Ha, 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 ha. This has been a perfect day. Well, you know, Ernie, the fun doesn't have to end. Why don't we have a good old-fashioned sleepover? Yeah! Really? Sure. Mi casa es su casa. Wow, your dad knows janitor language. I love it here. Come on to my room, Ernie. We can look at our boogers under the microscope. Cool. You can go to Cleveland. Cool! Oh, gross! Hey, y'all, so what are we grabbing on tonight? Oh, Ernie, you're back for dinner. Again. Yep. You said I could come over any time, so I'm moving in. Well, that's not exactly what if I... If Cleveland Jr.'s boyfriend gets to live here, then why can't mine? Okay, he can't live here, and Federline's definitely not gonna live here. Ah, sat on my nuts! Can I help you? Hi, Lester. This is a little awkward, but Ernie was talking about moving into my house, and I figured that you... that true, Ernie? You wanna live here or there? There, I reckon. Uh, boy's all yours. Hmm, well... Let's go home. I'll get out of these pants and you can play with Cleveland Jr. I shouldn't talk to boys. I brought all my stuff. My kit, my caboodle, my doodads, my doohickeys, my doojiggers, my giggles. <laughs> We're gonna be roommates. Oh, perfect. Just what we need, another dude. Would it kill somebody to bring home a hot Puerto Rican chick who's into black midgets? And this is Princess, my pet possum. <laughs>